Hey, sweet friends. Welcome to the Zippy's Club Journal series where I am going to go through the journal with you each and every day and go through the pages so that you have somebody to do the journal with. So let's start with the introduction page. Welcome to Zippy's Club, sweet friend. I'm so glad you are here. I created this journal to help you go on an exploration of discovering your best self so you can live your best life. Let's face it, we can all be kinder, become more grateful, and enjoy our lives more. Gratitude rewires our brains. That's what this book will help you to do. It will teach us to look for the blessings of life. The amazing part is that when we start looking for the blessings of life, we will see them everywhere. Our life is like a lens of a camera. Whatever we focus on is what we will see. If you want a different life, start looking at it differently. If I only took pictures of the bad parts of life, I could convince you that this world is terrible. The same is valid for good. If we teach our brains to look for good, we can see the beauty of our world. To get the benefits of this practice, I encourage you to use it daily. Before you open your journal and begin, I recommend that you find a comfortable place to sit and relax. Close your eyes for a few moments and breathe deeply. Read the positive statement at the top of each page. Let it sink into your mind. Please spend a few minutes reading this statement and thinking about it. List three things you're grateful for and three things you love. Write three new things each day. I don't let myself do the same three things every day. I make myself write something different. That way I look, I go on a treasure hunt of my day and just look for the good things. Completing this list helps train your mind to look for the good. Serving others is one of the most incredible things we can do to show God's love. Every day I look around and try to find someone who needs help. They might need a smile, someone to sit with on during lunch, or a friend to talk with. However, if you decide to help someone else, be sincere and follow your heart. Next, please do some exercise for 30 minutes. It makes us feel good to run, dance, play, whatever you want to do. We should do something every day to make ourselves feel good. Finally, write about a positive experience in your day. If you do it in the morning, you can pick an incident from the previous day. Make sure to include your five senses. Once you've done everything, read the Bible verse and try to memorize it. Allow God's word to help you. It can give us hope, peace, and instruction and help us live our best lives. Before each week, there is a question and answer section. It will help you to measure your progress. You will be different when you finish this practice. Here is living your best life and becoming the person God created you 